every Yolan trailer so far has been an absolute masterpiece. This is the final one, and this is her collected miscellany called Traceless Stealth. Let's get into it. I'm excited. I am sad it's the final one, but let's check it out. In the business of national security, Dane's left. the public eye poses many restrictions. While trouble brews in the shadows, it helps to bring in special talent. Someone who can move freely between different circles, covering their tracks as they go. Right. But be warned, this kind of collaboration could cost you, so make sure it's worth the price. <laughs> Who's our target this time? Oh my gosh. Man. Is a master of the bow, whose hydro vision takes her abilities to new heights. Stronger and more daring than most, she thrives in dangerous situations, leading her enemies slowly but surely into her trap. You see, yeah, she's surrounded. For Yelan, staying alert to new intel of all kinds is second nature. Wherever she goes, whatever she does. Like why she got to look always so always returns with a wealth of resources. Good. When Yelan is dispatched on a 20-hour expedition in Liyu, she will obtain increased rewards. Ooh. Yelan's That's really good. attack can combo up to four consecutive shots, dealing physical damage. Right. Holding the attack button executes a more precise shot that deals increased damage. <laughs> that poor slum. Aiming, flowing water accumulates on the arrowhead. A okay, so she has like a supercharged attack. Hydro damage on hit. Yeah. After leaving combat for a short time, Yelan gains the breakthrough effect, which greatly decreases the charge time of her next aimed shot. Oh, wow. And fires a breakthrough barb at full charge. The breakthrough barb deals AoE hydro damage that nice. scales based on Yelan's max HP. When she casts her elemental skill, Yelan moves rapidly using her lifeline. Latching onto and marking enemies as she goes. I like that a lot. Skill, that looks really cool. Effects. When tapped, Yelan rapidly dashes forward a short distance. While held, Yelan remains in a rapid movement state. And it looks gains so fast, to dude. While in that state. Looks faster than like. This time, Yelan can Sire. control the direction she sprints in and can cast the skill again to exit the rapid movement state. Using this skill. She can quickly approach groups of enemies while easily avoiding some of their attacks. Furthermore, it helps her explore the surrounding terrain more rapidly. <laughs> nice. When rapid movement ends, Lifeline will explode and deal hydro damage to marked enemies based on Yelan's max HP. Also, so if your HP is really when high. Lifeline explodes. The number of enemies marked affects her chance to gain the breakthrough effect. The more enemies marked, the higher the chance to gain the effect. Oh, okay. So the ring. Game's up. Fun's over. When okay. Yelan unleashes her elemental burst, she deals AoE hydro damage to nearby enemies and creates an exquisite throw to assist in battle. Wow. Exquisite throw follows the active character. And of course, they use Hu Tao. Normal attack. Or Yelan's lifeline explodes and hits an enemy. Exquisite throw will join in the attack, dealing hydro damage based on Yelan's max HP. Ooh. After unlocking the talent Adapt with Ease, the active character's damage dealt gradually increases while Exquisite Throw is present. Oh, okay. If the elemental burst is cast again while this effect is active, the effect will be cleared. Mm. Before the fun of guessing the enemy's next move begins, Yelan inspects her hand and tallies up her strengths. After unlocking the talent Turn Control, Yelan's max HP is increased. Based on the number of elemental types in the party, the oh, more okay. elemental types, the greater the increase. Wherever there is intrigue, Yelan is in the background, quietly weaving her web. By the time her prey notices, it's already too late. <laughs> in battle, Yelan likes to open with her breakthrough bar. Before right. using her elemental skill to approach nearby enemies, she ensnares her targets with lifeline, then lets it explode and deal damage. After the explosion, if she has the breakthrough effect, Yelan may follow up with another breakthrough bomb to inflict oh, further damage. Oh, wow. So it's two? When energy is full, 
Yevon unleashes her elemental burst. Oh my gosh, you and Mia. Providing hydro damage and a damage boost. Oh man. So the team can round up the remaining foes. It's vape. Oh, Fate man. is a cruel and perilous thing. It bodes only ill, lurking in dark places like the chasm. To me, that place is the epitome of human misfortune. <laughs> People died there, far from their homes. People with hopes and dreams, dutiful oh. to the bitter end. Different motivations resulted in the same tragic conclusion. People ought to fear disaster, unless they can learn to draw strength from their fear. Perhaps Yelan is just such a unique case. Undeterred by fate's cruel design, there is no path she will not go down in the pursuit of secrets. But what if, one day, she descends into a place from which there is no escape? I am curious, by which of her many sides, would she see herself be remembered? Dane Slap always has me thinking, man. I swear. Like, what is, you know, like, it's always, it's always with him. But anywho, the character looks really, really cool. Considering that she is a DPS, I'm hoping that her burst is, like, very, very strong. Like, just be strong. You know, if you're going to be called a DPS, be strong you know um i haven't seen anything yet like actual gameplay of it i have yet to actually see it myself 2.7 is out now while you're watching this so i'm sure i'm sure you guys know already but yeah i'm excited to try her out i'll be trying her out tomorrow over on twitch and yeah i mean she looks super fast with her her little elemental skill her burst looks insane it looks like it fires so fast constellations seem like they're going to be pretty good as well so i'm excited i hope you guys are enjoying her i hope she's absolutely busted and if she is just you know Keep, keep it on the down low, you know, don't, don't, don't make high over us nerf her, you know, just <laughs> let's have fun. Her skill is like stupid fast, man. Like, I think she might be like faster than Sayu maybe. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the reaction and the trailer itself. I hope you guys are enjoying 2.7. The teapot is back. Yolan is insane in all kinds of different ways. But that'll do it for me. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will catch you guys in the next one.